welcome to mechanical tutorial i am going to teach you different techniques in solid works for mechanical engineers i am going to train you different modules like surface modeling sheet metal and enclosure design product design plastic components design reverse engineering and many more tips and tricks in solid works hi today i am going to explain about copying a surface from one path to another path that is with a top down approach and this is the copying surface blue color on the component and i am going to create a surface by copying the surface and going to create a gasket component so let's start now so this is the component and i am going to create a gasket on this surface so for that we have to go to new assembly file since we are doing in a top down approach we have to take new assembly file so i have already created one assembly file here we have to assemble the reference component so keep it in float condition So now I am going to create a gasket feature. So we here we need to take one new part file. So I have already created one blank part file. See so here this is. So create a, a simple surface feature on the top plane. So I am going to take one sir circle. and go to surface create a planar surface this is just for identification how we are going to place this in the assembly so for better identification i am taking one color now go to assembly now insert the gasket component place it somewhere outside now we have to take references for mating condition so front plane with front plane So right with right plane so for top plane instead of uh, selecting plane we have to select the top face of this component and this insert surface So keep in MMS. Now, before explaining about this copying surface, I'm going to explain with the conventional method. That is using sketch. So delete this uh, sketch and uh, select this face 
go to convert entity it selects the outer edges of the component now we have to go to convert entities and select the face once again but we have to select all inner loop and say okay it will show an error but we have to say okay then it automatically creates the internal sketch see here now come out of the sketch so since we have uh, deleted the surface it is showing the error so here come out of this sketch so in to avoid such problem instead of selecting the insert surface we can select the top plane of the gasket component say okay top down approach we have to rectify these kind of errors now this surface is created now now we have to add thickness to the surface so go to this component go to surface module and select thicken option say okay and give one mm thickness so the material is added one direction so let's see in the assembly see here so the gasket thickness is added so this is one method mostly we use this method but now i am going to explain using copying surface so i am going to this component deleting this these two features now the component is already assembled in the assembly file now we have to go to this gasket component we have to go to edit part then we have to go to surface we have to select this top surface simply this top surface you can see this top surface is selected the blue color highlighted and uh, there is no copy surface so we have to use offset surface and make it zero distance this is nothing but copying surface exactly at this location so simply this uh, gasket surface is created now now we can go to gasket component so this feature is created so there is no sketch at all and sketch and planar surface simply there is a offset surface simply we need to select this and go to thicken option and give 1 mm thickness see this gasket feature is created now with some thickness 1 mm thickness so this gasket can be created with a single step copying the surface and just making the thickness so this is the easiest way to create the gasket component so this is brief about copying a surface from one part to other part with a top down approach thank you very much